learning English may be the biggest factor in the jobs you can get and the money you can earn. Hi, I'm Michelle, and I want to tell you about Hello Channel, an exciting new channel that teaches you English as you're watching TV. As you watch Hello Channel, you'll see, read, hear, and speak English, and before you know it, you'll be on your way to a better job and a brighter future. All you have to do is say hello. Pumpkin chocolate chip cookies are my favorite cookies to make, mainly because they're the easiest cookie I know how to make. Can you believe with only three ingredients you can get incredible cookies? I'm going to show you how. All you're going to need is a spice cake mix. Just dump that right in. Any brand will work. I tend to go for what's on sale. Next, a can of pumpkin. Really doesn't get any easier, let me tell you. And these are fabulous cookies. Okay, that's in. Next, we're gonna mix this with an electric mixer. I recommend using the electric mixer because it will help create a more cake-like fluffy uh, texture. You can do this with a spoon, um, but like I said, you're not really gonna get that texture that you really want. Speed this up just a bit. I love these cookies. They remind me of baking for the holidays. Pumpkin's a great ingredient to use, you know, in the fall, towards the holidays. Okay, looking pretty good. Kind of flying everywhere. Now I'm just going to take my wooden spoon. Work this just a bit. Oh, these are so good. This is a must. Let me tell you, you try these, you'll be trying them over and over and over and over again. Okay, that looks pretty well blended. Not bad at all. Now for the most important ingredient, the chocolate chips, of course. I like using a whole bag because the more chocolate, the better, right? So just dump this all in there. I'm using milk chocolate chips today, but you can use anything you'd like. Semi-sweet or fabulous in this recipe as well. This is also a great dough that you can freeze. I freeze this all the time and then I've always got cookies on hand. It's kind of a nice thing to throw together at the last second when you need a dessert. Okay, now that those chocolate chips are incorporated, I am going to use a cookie scoop. Now, a cookie scoop you can buy at most cooking stores. If you don't have a cookie scoop, you can use an ice cream scoop. Do the same thing. The reason you want to use a cookie scoop is because your cookies will be more uniform, all the same size. And look how quick and easy it is just to throw these babies on this cookie sheet. After you've done this, I like to take my wooden spoon and just flatten them out just a little bit. I tend to like the shape of the cookie better. Oh, they smell good. They haven't even cooked yet. Okay, that's about it. Can you believe it? Three ingredients, under five minutes, guaranteed some of the best cookies you're ever gonna try. I'm gonna stick them in the oven at 350 for about 15 minutes. And once they come out, you're going to have cookies that look like this. It's a fabulous, flavorful cookie that's got a nice, light and fluffy cake-like texture. And, hmm, doesn't get any better than this. It's a recipe you're definitely going to want to try.